Hello, I'm suppose you are running rightward at 4 meter per second and then you switch direction and you are running leftward at 4 meter per second. What's the change in your velocity? If you think that the answer is zero, then you are wrong. Huh? The change in your velocity is actually 8 meter per second leftward. Welcome to the world of vector subtraction. So in the previous video, I've already shown you how to do a vector summation, right? So if you have a vector A and a vector B, if you want to do A plus B, just uh, join them up so that uh, this is A plus B. So what if we want to do A minus B instead? Minus B, right? So if you want to do A minus B, you've got to flip the B around first. So now you have the, this vector here that represents a negative B. Now you join these two vectors up again, yeah? Start N, start N. So, as usual, you join the very start to the very end, and that vector will be A minus B. Do you see how it works? We're actually doing A plus negative B, and therefore, we end up doing A minus B. Ah, clever, right? Okay, suppose a car is driving northward, at 10 meter per second and then it makes a right turn so now it's driving eastward at 10 meter per second what is the change in the car's velocity if you think this is the answer then you're wrong do you realize that you're actually doing initial velocity plus final velocity yeah so this vector is definitely wrong so what we want to do is the change in velocity so we have to take the final velocity minus away the initial velocity so to minus away the initial velocity you've got to flip it around first right you flip it around so now this vector represents negative uh, initial velocity so what do you do next ah as usual join them up start and start and so now this vector here which is actually vf plus negative vi turns out to be final velocity minus initial velocity so let's bring back the numbers it was all 10 meter per second right so it turns out the change in velocity is 14 meter per second just do the pythagoras yeah uh, in the south east direction so does it make sense to you Let, let's uh, bring back the story yeah so you were driving northward and then you were driving eastward so the change in your velocity turns out to be in a southeast direction. Does it make sense to you? It should, eh? Come to think of it, for your velocity to change from northward to eastward, you must first get rid of the northward 10 meter per second. So there has to be a southward change of 10 meter per second before you do the eastward change of 10 meter per second. So the eastward change plus the southward change gives you this south easterly direction velocity change get it okay ta ta